Hey everybody, welcome back to GSC. This is going to be very unusual, but we have my whole entire Angry Bird collection. I'm so glad to show you. And as you can see right now, I am wearing my Angry Birds onesie. It's actually pretty comfortable, to tell you the truth. But what do you say? Let's get into this bag. Oh, and before we get into this, I just want to say a few things. If you have not subscribed, be sure to hit the subscribe button. At least give me at least one like, maybe two or three views. But other than that, let's see. Okay, so I have been collecting Angry Birds for at least five years now. And I, um, yep, these are all of them. Most of them I got on eBay. And, um, yeah. So let's start with um, our classic red bird. He is pretty common, and this is the one with legs. You can just kind of jiggle him around. I kind of like that. But yep, this is our very first bird to look at. Now let's take a look at the red without legs. He is pretty unique, too. Um, yeah, I think I like the balls better. They're just, they look more like the game and they're easy to toss, throw and catch and all that. Now let's take a look at Chuck. Also pretty classic. Not as popular as Red, but pretty popular. He, his legs can also kind of jingle around. I actually kind of like that. But that's, uh, that's him. Now let's take a look at the Chuck without legs. Still pretty unique. Um, still, I think I like this one better. Easier to toss. Looks more like the game. But yeah, I definitely like this one. Up next is Jay. A lot of people call him Blue, but his real name is Jay. He has two other friends named Jake and Jim. But, yep, this is him. He's blue, just like a little blue jay. He has real feathers on top, even on the tail. And, yep, now we're going to take a look at the jay without legs. Definitely like this one better. And, yeah, see, easier to toss, looks more like the game. Yeah, and just think, if you used red and chuck, if you were... If you know how to juggle, you could just juggle these. Or if it's easier for you, you could use two. Or if you're more of an expert, you can use three. But yep, you could seriously juggle with these. Now let's take a look at Bomb. Bomb is pretty unique too. Still has the legs that can jiggle. Jay, eh, his legs, they can't really jingle. But Bomb's legs, they can jiggle all right. But now let's take a look at the Bomb without legs. This guy is pretty unique. And I like him better, but this this Bomb with um, legs is actually very cool too. I do certainly have to admit. But let's take a look at Matilda. Matilda is also very unique. Yes, Matilda is very unique, yeah. I love the purple hair. I love the little eyelashes. I love the cheeks. And then also we have the Matilda without legs. These two are also very unique. And yeah. Stella, let's take a look at her. Her legs are very jingly. She has the longest legs, and she was at the beach. She could just sit down in a chair. But, yep, she she is actually Chuck's girlfriend, just like Matilda is Red's girlfriend. I'm not sure if you guys knew that, but, yeah, that's true. I don't have the Stella with a ball, but we can look at some more. Up next is Boomerang. I love Boomerang. Super squishy. This one has a bow for some reason. A lot of people don't have a bow and it's dark green, but 
This boomerang, for some reason, it must be a girl if it has a bow. And it's like a lighter shade of green. I don't have the one with legs, but that's okay. Next up, we have Bubbles. I'm not sure why they made him so big, because he's like the second most small bird. But for some reason, um, they just chose to make him big, for some reason. And yeah. Our next bird is going to be... Not to disappoint you guys for this next one, but it's just a little purple hatchling. Kind of like Jay over here. The legs can't really, the feet can't really move. Although it is purple. Did you guys know that purple is my favorite color? Brown eyes. And it's supposed to be like a little keychain. You know, just a little keychain looking thing. This next one will be good. Because it will be our pigs. These are why the birds are so angry. The pigs will always steal their eggs. We have... I'm not sure if this pig has a name, but he's still pretty cool. But this guy I know is King Leonard. He's the king of every single pig. And believe it or not, I have a duplicate of Matilda that talks. Let's see... Hold on. Just like Red over here also talks. His battery's gone down a little low, but not like Matilda. But yeah, I think Matilda sounds just a tiny bit more clear. Our next bird will be Blue. He is, um, if he doesn't look familiar, then that's because he's in a game called Angry Birds Rio. Um, that was a pretty popular game. And his girlfriend actually is Juliet. The eyelashes even kind of stick out right here, and so it does on the other side. And yeah, that's Juliet. She goes along with Blue. But yep. Alright guys, go along. Our next bird, or should I say animal, will be a monkey. He, um, he's definitely not a bird. His name is Morris. He is also, if you don't recognize him from the game, Angry Birds Rio. And yeah, after this we have one more bird to look at. This is also a bad guy, and the next one will be a bad guy as well. Like, I Joel. I had to save the best for last, right? He's also from the game Angry Birds Rio. He trapped, um, Red, Chuck, and Jay. Including these two guys, um, Juliet and Blue. But then they got angry and broke free. But yeah, I Joel, when I first got him, he was a little tinier than I expected, but he's still a pretty cool guy. But uh, yeah, just uh, thank you for watching, and uh, yeah. Yeah, thank you for watching, guys. Huh? Ah, not I Joel! Uh, get back here!